Hello and welcome to FourCornersTV.com. I'm Laura Schweizer and this is the local roundup for Tuesday, December 23rd. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas, finally. There was a nice little dusting here in town, but what's most noteworthy was the wind. Red Mountain Pass measured 117 mile per hour gusts of wind. DMR ended up having to shut down as trees were getting knocked down. And power lines were at the mercy of those trees as they tried to withstand the wind. As for your snowcast, sorry to be the bear of bad news, but it ain't looking like it's going to be a white Christmas. Now the weather got a little windy on the top of Looking Glass Arch. Watch as 4CTV's very own Daredevil scales one of Moab's hot spots. But the wind isn't the only fear factor. Catch an all new breaking point at 2 p.m. today, only here on Four Corners TV. One area residents are begging to put back into good use McPhee Reservoir. It used to be a hot spot, but recently recreation has dwindled. After budget cuts, nixed bathrooms, a fish cleaning area, and a campsite, the area isn't seeing much action. So now the county is wanting to take action by taking over. Although handing over federal land to the county takes a few hoops to jump through. Speak your stance on the swap until January 30th. But don't lose any sleep over the matter. One way to protect your beauty rest? Turn off those cell phones. A study found that people who were on their light emitting device before bed had a worse night's sleep than those who weren't. They had reduced levels of melatonin and spent less time in REM sleep. Over time, this adds up, affecting our overall health. So ditch the phone and iPad before bed. We'll all be sleeping soundly tomorrow when Santa arrives, but it looks like Santa came early this year. Our very own Ayla met up with the big man in red. But what does Mr. Claus want for Christmas? Find out today on In the Neighborhood at 3 p.m. The holidays are always a time when laughter and liquor are aplenty. Typically, offices don't allow drinking on the job, but researchers have found that a certain level of inebriation sparks your level of creativity. Hence the creation of the Problem Solver. It's an IPA stocked with a scale so that drinkers can get to their peak level of ingenuity. Thanks for watching the local roundup on FourCornersTV.com. I'm Laura Schweizer, and I'll see you tomorrow.